Hello and welcome back to Unshape Tutorial. Today let's just talk about the drawings that how can you create 2D drawings from 3D parts. I have this simple model and I just want to create a 2D drawing uh, from this model inside Unshape. I will click on the plus icon and go for create drawings. And this time uh, I will choose an existing template inside the Unshape and choose the ISO. I will use a 3 size sheet and I will just hit OK. I was just creating drawings for me of the A3. Okay, so the page is open over here, and just you can just zoom in and zoom out by just control and scrolling up the middlemost bottom. Uh, place it in the first angle of projection, as you can see over here. You can just put some of the other details regarding your drawing. Just double click uh, with the middlemost bottom to just fit your view, and this time. I'll just go and we'll just insert a view and I'll just click on insert and this time I'll just choose the model and I'll just put it somewhere here all right and now I'll just go and we'll just go for the isometric view and and then you can go for the projected view and select this view and drop it down somewhere here all right all you have done and just you can just uh drag them by just fitting them together and i think it's fine for me right now and just double click on any view you can just uh choose the view orientation for this time i'm just keeping it at the front view and you can just scale up the things like you just you can you can keep these at the view scale according uh like you can just change them by one ratio two it would just gets a bit smaller than the one i want to be and uh tangent edges and view level all right this is my front view i don't want to be half and scale view because already I have just adjust them together all right the uh, detail view uh, and right now I want to make a detail view some view here like this and uh, you can just adjust the scale from here and I just want to be keeping it 101 and you can keep it the detail view some view here and okay now as the uh, detail view represents a over here and we'll just pop up a just double click you just uh for example it just want to be having a b and now it will just adjust itself all right uh now uh next what you can do is just to go and finally uh you can create the dimensions uh i'll go for the dimension and right now i just want to be having uh this dimension and i want to be having from this point uh till this point this much i want to be having this dimension and i want to be having this dimensions this dimensions and you can go and just define this dimension and right now is uh, I just define I think all things just remaining this inner circles dimension and this one diameter of 25 and then I'll just define this dimension see I uh, try to avoid of the uh, dimensions uh, that you need to mention again and again and you can go in for smart dimensions right I think I just mentioned all the things so then just double click and just adjust your view and right now uh, if you want to change uh, like like all these things so you just double click and define the way you want to be I think it's, it's really very easy for you people to write down your basics informations uh, and then 
you can go in the define uh, data planes and uh, for example I just wanna be having this data plane some view here I'll hit OK and then you can just uh, write down something uh, like for example you just wanna be having enter like this and keep it bold and the size you can just increase them see uh, and you can just define colors each and everything like the way you want to be and I think it's 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 really easy for you people to do it right you can just uh, add a table uh, define rows define columns and if you want to put it somewhere here and then you can just put details inside this table right and then uh, Two points of the lines, each and everything you can just, I think, uh, it's it's not really difficult for you people. You can just insert uh, DXF files or the DWG file from the AutoCAD, and search images for Painter. And once we've done all the things, just right click and export as a, a PDF format file, right? And I'll just export. Alright. So, I just export this drawing and you can just open your PDF file right here. Oh, it's great. Mm. Thanks for watching. Make sure to subscribe to this channel.